yield, I'd like to yield time to Mr. Williams, the gentleman from Texas, for his comments. Uh, thank you, uh, Dr. Harris. And uh, Mr. Speaker, I'd like to take this time to recognize pro-life pregnancy centers and all the good they do for mothers and their unborn children. As a God-fearing father and grandfather, I have always believed that life begins at the moment of conception. No one should ever be forced to promote the abortion of an unborn baby against their will. Rather than protecting free speech, a constitutional right, the federal government is extorting speech by forcing these pregnancy centers to contradict their pro-life message. During my time in Congress, I have visited multiple pro-life pregnancy centers around the 25th District of Texas. In particular, I'd like to highlight the Austin Pregnancy Resource Center and the Cleburne Pregnancy Center, both of which I have been to. These outstanding centers provide resources, information, and emotional support for those soon-to-be moms. They also provide aftercare for moms and their baby, such as supplies, clothing, and education, as we pre previously heard. Women deserve to know there are better options than abortion and that there are facilities out there to help them. Bottom line, Americans and organizations around should not be forced by the government to promote ideas that conflict with their beliefs. As a steadfast pro-life supporter, I will continue advocating for the rights of the unborn and the centers that fight for them. In God we trust, I yield my time back.